What is happening here? FDC President Dr. Kiza BSJ arrives at the Lairie grounds at about 11 a.m. together with colleagues from the Interparty Corporation for what should have been the start of a fairly routine demonstration against the continued stay of the Electoral Commission. He then leads the demonstrators to clock tower grounds, but they are welcomed by mean-faced anti-riot police. Lacking in the background is a Kiboko squad that soon charges at curious onlookers and whips them out of the area. Shortly, after CP leader Ken Luchamzi and the leader of opposition in parliament, Professor Maurice Ogenga Latigo, also arrives but are denied entrance into the clock tower grounds. Which place? What is this place? Is this a police station? What is this place? You are the one I should be asking what you are doing here. We are asking you humbly to vacate this place and go ahead and do your own jobs or work. If they want to beat, they can start charging on us and beat. Otherwise, I don't see you are the people who are totally out of place. However, Kampala Metropolitan Police Commander Andrew Soreni's order to leave is ignored and a scaffold soon ensues that lasts nearly three minutes. As the country celebrates Heroes Day, the IPC leaders and the members are saying they're using this time to organize the public and inform them about the need for electoral reforms. The question that remains, will the government heed their calling? After failing to make headway here, Bestia sneaks off to Katwe as hundreds of youth join his convoy before they converge at the Katwe grounds. But it was a short-lived moment. We are simply peacefully telling our people say no to rigged elections. The anti-riot police again catches up with the group and scatters it. At around 1.15 p.m., Bestia retreats to parliament to meet the leader of opposition, Professor Latigo, but he is blocked by the police from getting in. After almost 40 minutes of fruitless negotiations, Besja and his group give up and leave. 